Edge Grove School kicked off the new school year in style with an amazing week of creativity across the curriculum inspired by the music and poetry of Vivaldi's Four Seasons. It's been a whole school focus and that everybody's looking forward to the concert, everybody's kind of coming and going, oh wow, and people have had a go and, you know, because it's so, you can link it so widely like with the leaves and looking at the leaves and looking at the maths and the poetry and actually going and using our sight. So the week culminated with two performances of Vivaldi's Four Seasons painted to in real time by the internationally acclaimed children's author and artist James Mayhew. The final concert was held in a sports hall in order to accommodate every Edgegrove pupil from reception to year eight, as well as the four local state schools who were involved. Early in the week, we held an open rehearsal in the assembly hall where the classes visited throughout the day. We also talked with the children about the instruments and the process of rehearsing and preparing for the performance. for the whole week and worked with all the children giving painting to music workshops. The children got to know Vivaldi's Four Seasons really well by the time of the performance. They also worked on Four Seasons themed subjects across the curriculum. So they started off looking at the four seasons. Yeah. Why do we have four seasons? The earth goes out of the sun, how it rotates, and then they looked at um, Copernicus and Galileo and all the planets and things, and that's how, it, how they got out of that. And temperatures. And, and, so so and suddenly, all these people that always got on Cosmo suddenly come out of the woodwork. And I think it's the concept, we're very much looking at growth mindset. And looking at how to say it, I can't do it yet and having the positive yeah, yeah. Uh, you know how can I look at this in a different way how can I solve this problem creatively so I think in terms of giving them free rate and linking it across it and it's very much about linking it across okay I can't do maths but how do I approach it in this subject well I should try it this way around exactly like practicing you know yeah absolutely anything